James Steele Gracie was born in Newton, Massachusetts on August 24, 1927, the son of Ernest and Edna Gracie. After graduating from Needham High School, he was appointed as a cadet to the U.S. Coast Guard Academy. He graduated with an engineering degree in June 1949 and remained at the academy as a temporary instructor in the tactics department until the following September. He next served a short time patrolling the North Atlantic as deck officer aboard the Barataria. In 1951, Jim was assigned to the port office in Boston, Massachusetts. Next, he enrolled at Harvard University, earning a Master's of Business Administration in 1956. In July that year, he reported to Coast Guard Headquarters, Washington, D.C. as a branch chief in the Supply Division. After four years on shore, he took command of the buoy tender Mariposa, serving the coast of Connecticut, Long Island, and the Hudson River. Jim went on to serve as Comptroller, 2nd Coast Guard District, St. Louis, Missouri, and then as Executive Officer of the Coast Guard Base at Governor's Island, New York. After promotion to Captain in 1969, he returned to headquarters as Chief of the Programs Division under the Chief of Staff. Jim was promoted to Rear Admiral in 1974 and assumed command of the 9th Coast Guard District in Cleveland, which covered operations in the Great Lakes. Having risen through the ranks, Admiral Gracie understood what it felt like to be a new flag, and he joined the capstone program as a senior fellow to give his insights to flags following after him. Mrs. Gracie felt so strongly about the importance of the program, she developed and taught for many years the Executive Development Lecture Series for Spouses at Capstone. Returning to headquarters again, he served as Chief of Staff of the U.S. Coast Guard. Upon promotion to Vice Admiral, he assumed command of the Coast Guard Pacific Area and the 12th District in San Francisco. Then he went back to the East Coast to command the Atlantic Area and 3rd District. Promoted to Admiral, he assumed the position of Commandant of the Coast Guard on 28 May 1982. Under his command, he successfully battled against legislation to privatize many Coast Guard functions. He also improved fleet readiness through modernization and the addition of more vessels and helicopters. Jim led the Coast Guard through operations and disaster relief, including the largest fire in Virginia history, support of the 1983 invasion of Grenada, and operation of Blue Lightning, where Coast Guard forces seized record amounts of illegal drugs. Other high-profile operations included participation in the Space Shuttle Challenger response and the UNITAS program. Jim stated that his greatest accomplishment during his tenure as Commandant was the ability to keep the U.S. Coast Guard afloat, keep it on an even keel, and keep it moving forward. An impressive career with continuing dedication to the Coast Guard, sea services, and protection of our shores. The United States Navy Memorial presents the 2015 Lone Sailor Award to Admiral James S. Gracie.